right on. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Well, this is R. You're yeah. watching now, and uh, I'm Morton doing doing the vocals. What's what's uh, Morton in uh, in your mother language? Well, See, it means... My name is my, my name is uh, uh, actually uh, phonetically uh, uh, Kobayashi Katsuya, but in English it's Katsuya Kobayashi. You know, it's a little different. Mm. <laughs> it sounds very different. Very, <laughs> very different, right? How different? I want to see how. Morton. 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 It is. Reminds me of something to eat. Meat, mutton, <laughs> mutton, <laughs> and rotten. <laughs> All right. um, uh, I'm Max. I play keyboards. Yeah. And this is Paul. My name is Paul. What's I your play... name in Norwegian, Max? Yeah, come on. Morgen the fjord, Olsen. Great. Yeah. And, and I'm Paul. Yeah. Paul, Paul is the same, almost. Uh, yeah. Paul. 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 Mm -hmm. Paul never changes. <laughs> And you're all young, uh, still healthy. Yeah, mm. you have been together uh, about three years now. Three years. Mm. I understand uh, you're individually from different group, which are pretty much active in uh, Norway. Well, I was sort of in different bands, but they've been together. Oh. Mm. We sort of had the same history. Oh, yeah. um, we grew up in the same neighborhood, mm. and uh, when we were about ten years old, I think we met and uh, formed our first band. Which was mm. called? Uh, oh, I can't remember. The, the first one? one? <laughs> Spider Empire, was it? Spider Empire. It sounds like Don't heavy metal. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, well, I mean, my grandfather had an electric guitar. So that's it's a heavy metal. That's a family. Uh, oh, yeah, it's a family. family. So that's a three generation band. That's the reason, you know, that Paul wants to start a band with me. So I, had, mm. I was the only kid in the street with an electric guitar. You know? oh, it's the only reason. That's the only reason. When was this band? And I still have it. That's in Oslo, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, what was happening then uh, in Oslo? Uh, not much. Not much. School. <laughs> mm. uh, you mean the music scene or mm -hmm. the music scene? Yes. Uh, or I mean, you get you, uh, you listen to a lot of imported stuff, right? Oh, yeah. I mean, most Norwegian most bands were copying American and English bands at mm. that time. Yeah. So uh, we listened to Jimi Hendrix and The Doors and stuff like that. Yeah. And the uh, Beatles. When was the uh, first time uh, when you uh, came up with your own? Oh, well, that was uh, quite early. Uh, I think a couple of days later. <laughs> a couple of days we later. We started sort of writing. I think when we were about 14, mm -hmm. uh, and we did, did a, a self-financed album eventually. Yeah. Uh, with our own songs on, on our sold own label. Sold about two copies. Sold very. We like to say it sold very well among family and friends. Yeah. And that's the sort of <laughs> terminals. Um, and that's it, really. We've sort of been together all through, you know, throughout our childhood. Uh -huh. When, uh, how did you write the song, uh, then? When just the way we do it now. Yeah. Just the, yeah, the acoustic guitar or uh, yeah. keyboard. Whatever. That's what I want to know, yeah, yeah. I remember yeah. actually reading in the local newspaper about uh, a band of 14 and 15 year olds who, mm. who were definitely going to England to make it there. Mm. And uh, <laughs> these are the guys. <laughs> So in, that's been the plan, that really, for quite a few years. And I met them uh, three and a half years ago, I think. Mm. And we uh, and joined them, and we formed our heart. What did and you left. What did you think? But well, you were still a teenager, right? At that time, no. No, no this, was, this was three years ago. <laughs> oh. No, I'm 26 now, so... Mm. Uh, well, he I was, was 22. He was a teenager until he was 24, so you're right. <laughs> <laughs> so you have been wanting to go to England? Uh, or the States? That was uh, the England. plan from, yeah. from day one. England was to us the, the center of the world, at least in our part of the world, mm. when it comes to rock and pop music. It's a very small place, you know, and so much happening there yeah, yeah, all the time. Yeah. When you went there, uh, where did you find it? Were, were you intrigued with, uh, with all the, uh, the groups they had, uh, music there? Mm. Intrigued with the rat race, maybe. Oh, you know, oh. It's, uh, it's such a but I think we, we expected it all. We, yeah. You know, we knew that England had a lot of bands. Right. And that the competition would be mm. fierce. Easy. Mm. That's, that's, <laughs> one, that's one of the reasons we, mm. we think oh. that we wanted to compete with those bands. Right. And you have to tell us about the, the, the tour. You're just about ready. Uh, you are ready for the tour, right? I mean, any particular plan for you to this way oh yeah oh yeah definitely definitely but we don't have any fixed dates yet if japan's open for us we'll come is your uh, concert going to be a, a, a little 
a straight uh, rock and roll type, or uh, in a way, yeah. Uh, we're not going to use, uh, but we don't light. know. I mean, we have to figure it out. No, of it'll course, change. But we'll, yeah. But it'll definitely not be a reproduction of the album no. because mm -hmm. we always That's thought that I mean. was very boring when you try to do the same thing on uh -huh. on stage as you've done in the studio. I mean, it's a completely different thing, and uh, we don't want to use computers or backing tracks or anything. You know, I mean, it's a two-way thing, communication with the audience. Using, in other words, you won't be using tape. Oh, no, no, no we don't want to do uh, that. Oh, no. yeah. It really sort of locks you in, so you have to stick to, you know, listen to the drum machine instead of improvising. And you know, all the songs are written on either guitar or piano, and the way that they're, they're done on the album is just one way to do it. Yeah. It's, uh, it's one so way of arranging. When them. you perform, it's going to be longer and uh, maybe hotter. Maybe shorter. Maybe <laughs> different. Yeah, maybe shorter. Yeah. Probably maybe. less sophisticated and more direct, you know, mm -hmm. more... Uh, yeah. Less, less details and more dynamics. And, uh, 